Hi there, I'm meteorologist Chicago Windler. It's been a couple of nice sunny days, now plan on cooler weather, cloudy skies, and periodic showers. Best rain chances will come Wednesday evening and night, and then again Thursday night into Friday morning. That Thursday night to Friday morning time frame, we could even see some thunderstorms, which potentially could bring some heavy rain. Right now I'm thinking one to two inches of rain, not out of the question. Here's more in tonight's Chicks Tap. And we start you with a look at your Wednesday planner. Just a 20% chance of a shower in the morning, 30% by noon, 50% by late afternoon, and 60% chance in the evening. High temperature, only 53 degrees. So we went from 70s Monday to 60s Tuesday to what will end up being only 50s on a Wednesday with high temperatures perhaps only in the upper 40s out toward Burnett, Lano close to that in Mason. So yes, some chillier air will be pulling through. And watch what happens on Thursday as we take this look at future track hour by hour. Showers will probably move in during the afternoon, evening hours, and then start to become more intense and widespread as we head through Thursday night and on into Friday morning. Take a look. You can see that that heaviest rain will be pulling right across central Texas probably wrapping up during the morning hours on Friday and any lingering showers should be out of here by the afternoon. Some computer models keep in more rain all the way through the afternoon, but I think this future track computer model is doing a pretty decent job. As for rain totals, all the way through Wednesday, hardly any, less than a tenth of an inch, maybe up to a quarter, but then Thursday night into Friday, that's when the rain really starts to come down. At this point, it looks like the heaviest will be off toward the east and northeast of the Austin area. The lightest out in the hill country, but the rain clears out by Saturday. We're nice and dry. Winter begins on Sunday, Monday and Tuesday, a cool but pleasantly cool 62, 63 degrees, which is still a little bit above normal for this time of year. Leading the way to Christmas. Christmas Eve, 66, mild. Thursday, Christmas Day, we could potentially hit 70, yes. 70 degrees. Definitely no white Christmas, maybe a very warm Christmas. Finally tonight, it is Time Lapse Tuesday. Check out this awesome display. This is out on Sharon Drive in Cedar Park. Tons of lights, all animating set to music. Pretty cool stuff. 